good is your internal spring? Here's a scenario. You walk in to a very important meeting. You hope to pitch your idea to 10 of the senior partners and you discover that uh, there are only five youngsters sitting in the room. Will you give up? Will you walk out? Or will you refocus and present as if your life depended on it? Sanjay Subramanyam, for those of you not aware, is the number one Carnatic music singer in the country. And this happened. He walks into an auditorium, which is supposed to have 600 people. There are hardly 50 people in the hall. Now, the organizers were embarrassed, so they actually met him before the event and said, we are sorry, due to some issues in traffic, the auditorium was almost empty. The question he asked is a question which all of us should understand and appreciate. He said, I've come down from, from Chennai to Mumbai to perform. Even if there are five people in the auditorium, I'll perform for them. And what a concert it was. And, and I was fortunate to have been in that auditorium that day. Well, there were only 50 of us in the auditorium, but there was a very, very senior journalist in the auditorium. And she wrote a absolutely glowing review of his concert in the next week's uh, Mumbai Mirror. Now, how did he achieve it? Because he said, I will refocus. I will refocus with the people who are there in the auditorium. Are you capable of refocusing when the key people are not in the room? Now, it's a form of rejection. And in my new book, uh, Spring Bouncing Back from Rejection, I have looked at several rejection stories of my own, as well as stories I've learned from musicians, artists, uh, authors, academics, sports personnel, uh, movie makers, and more. We are living in challenging times, and we have to be ready to face obstacles, face rejection, face failure. But a lot will depend on how strong is your internal spring. Can you bounce back? Can you bounce back stronger? So hopefully the book will have some useful lessons for all of you to strengthen your internal spring so that you bounce back stronger, you refocus, re-energize and get back to your stride. So thank you for watching this and all the very best. Thank you.